There is a new Enforcer Assault Rifle coming to Fortnite, so I'm going to tell you what it does, when it's coming out, and where to find it. Okay, first up, this AR is already in the game accidentally, so when you kill the Vengeance Jones NPC in-game, he will drop this new weapon even before it's released in the new update. We did get a tweet about it from one of the leakers, so let's break that down. It looks like there's going to be all six rarities of the AR. There's going to be all the way from Grey to Mythic, and the Mythic AR is going to be replacing the Nemesis AR at Grand Glacier, which honestly never gets used. So let's break down everything we know about it. According to this tweet, apparently it works like an infantry rifle from Chapter 1 and is fully automatic, which I'm very excited to see because I love the infantry rifle because of how much it rewards its accuracy. Now, they're probably going to put the bullet drop like they have with every other assault rifle on to this gun which i'm not going to be too happy about but it does say it does fire slower and it hits harder especially at range so we do have that kind of medium to long range ar now whereas the assault rifles you kind of use close to mid range so you can kind of pick this thing over carrying a sniper and assault rifle if you carry both of those you can literally just combine this one into a singular weapon which i think is really good it gives you that extra option for an assault rifle because let's be honest no one really picks up the nemesis and that will give different playstyles for this meta with ARs. Because like like I said, if you're going to carry an AR, you only pick the striker AR for 90% of the time. I think this gun will be really good for the game and for the meta to hopefully do more damage and reward players with better aim rather than just rewarding a spray meta. But let's break down what this tweet actually says. So it says it's a quote-unquote infantry rifle. Its description is fully automatic assault rifle, fires slower, hits harder, especially at range. Well suited for medium to long range combat. Montague's Mythic Nemesis AR will be swapped in for it when it's finished. And then we go, then we have all of our stats here. So the grey one does 32 damage and then the Mythic one does a total of 40 damage. So there's only an 8 damage difference between the Mythic and the non-Mythic AR and the common AR, which is honestly not that big. But it does matter if it's actually a really hard hitting gun. Headshot damage is... 60 which honestly isn't that much it, i honestly think it would be a little bit more with an inventory at like a blue rarity it was like 88 headshot i swear it was really good damage and you could shoot really quick so i don't know i feel like this might need to be buffed a little bit but i'm not too sure its fire rate seems pretty good though same with the reload time seems very quick same with the legendary reload time is actually lower that's interesting and same with the Mythic, which is really good. But overall, I think this will be a better addition to the game than the Nemesis AR was. And hopefully it plays out well within the meta. That wraps this video up. Thank you for watching. Like and sub to push this out to other people. And I'll see you again. There was once a day that I would pray for you. I'd go and misbehave just so you'd notice too. Sneaking looks up and down from across the room. Damn, what a hell of a